In this video, I will show you how to use the statistics provided to help you administer the system. First, navigate to the Lock Lizard Administration System. Enter your user details and log in. Click on the Statistics tab. The high level statistics for your system are shown on the right hand side in the form of four pie charts and two bar charts. If you hover over the segments of the chart, a label is displayed, confirming what the information is related to. Same applies to the bar chart. On one of the pie charts, you have got buttons underneath. So here you can click on the button. This is to do with documents. If you want to see most accessed or the most viewed or the most printed. So you can click on specific buttons for the information on this particular chart. OK. These are all your high level statistics. On the left hand side is the main dashboard split into sections consisting of customers, documents, publications, backups and system subdivided into underlined headings. If you click any of these headings, like if we go for customers and then click on unregisters, it says that there are three unregistered customers. So if we click on it, straight away it takes us and shows us the three customers that are yet to register. To return to the statistics screen, click the back arrow. So any of these, if we click on them, like there's one expired record there, if we click on that, it takes us straight to that expired record so we can see exactly who it is with the click of a button. So again, back to the statistics screen. So we've got information on customers, documents, publications, and backups, and system information. Underneath that, we have a report section. And under that, the latest activity logs. So again, the report section is broken down to customers, documents, publications, and undelivered emails. If we look at one of the reports, if we have a look at publications this time, we click on publications, and here we have a list of all our publications. You have the option of sorting at the top of the record, and once you've got the information, you have the option of exporting it to a CSV format or printing this page. Close that window. At the bottom under the reports, as we said, is the latest activity logs. OK, these are all the latest events. If you want to view older ones up to six months ago, click the view all button. That shows you a much greater listing. And as you can see, there are several pages of it. Again, you have the option of exporting the information to a CSV spreadsheet. OK, let's have you with that. Close the window. If you have the e-commerce module activated on your system, you can also view the e-commerce activity by clicking on the e-commerce button here on the bottom. Here we have only one entry, OK, in this particular case. And again, we have the option to export it to a CSV file. Let's finish with that. Close the window. So that's a basic overview of the statistics area. Once you've finished viewing it, all you have to do, log out of the server and close the browser.